Writing tools are essential to written communication. Writing instruments have a long history and have helped societies write their history and bring civilization to life. When talking about the history of literacy, it is necessary to examine the history of writing technology. Writing is often referred to as one of the major communication revolutions in human history. Ong, in his book of 2002, points out that writing itself is a technology that calls for the use of tools and other equipment like writing instruments and surfaces. People recorded writings on various surfaces such as stones, metals, wood, wax and clay tablets, papyrus and parchment using different types of writing instruments. Like the evolution of man, writing instruments have taken a similar journey. The evolution of the pen has a direct correlation with the development of the accessories of writing such as papyrus, parchment, and paper. Through each millennium, there were innovations made to improve on the writing instruments based on the media to be written on. As man yearned to write and record more, the technology of the pen advanced. This is the story of the evolution of writing instruments from sharpened stone to ballpoint pen. This is a group of predecessors of today's modern pen. Each one had its place in the advancement of human history and mass literacy. The history of writing tools begins with the caveman, who invented the sharpened stone, which was later developed into the first writing tool. The sharpened stone was first used as a skinning and killing tool, but was later adapted to become the first writing instrument. Cavemen used these instruments to scratch pictures onto the walls of cave dwellings. The drawings were said to represent events in the daily life of the caveman, such as planting crops and hunting victories. Pros of this technology, the stone had multiple uses and helped lead to modern writing. The cons, it took strength in order to write and it was not portable. Overlooking the interesting part of our past, the true history of the pen begins with the invention of the paper made from papyrus thanks to the skilled Egyptian people. Millennia later, humans discovered that even the best rocks produced a very scraggly font. As human civilization progressed, so did the need for keeping records. The first innovation to the technology of the writing instrument came around 3000 BC in the land of the pharaohs. This was the development of the reed brush and reed pen and was used by the scribes to produce hieroglyphic and hieratic writings on papyrus scrolls. The development of these pens coincided with the use of papyrus as an effective writing surface. Reed pens, which were made of reed straw or bamboo, allowed the scribes to make marks on papyrus in a more precise way than reed brushes. So reed pens became the more common writing tool. Pros, it was easy to store and portable. It could go anywhere that the scribe was needed. Cons, reed pens have a problem of easily catching in the fibers of rough papyrus. After the Egyptians came the Greeks and writing became easier with the technological development and improvement of the writing instrument the earliest means of writing that approached pen and paper was developed by the ancient Greeks. This was the writing stylus and is the next innovation to the writing instrument. This technology was made from bone, metal or ivory. The stylus was used to write scribes notes on wax coated tablets. The pros, it is portable and can go anywhere that the scribe is needed to record history. Cons, hard to write with and is non-refillable. The 
next innovation came from the Romans and it was an improvement on the reed brush reed pen that came from ancient Egypt. What the Romans did to improve the pen was to begin using a bamboo stem. This stem became the primitive form of the fountain pen and it was cut at one end to form the pen nib or the point. The bamboo stem was then filled with ink which was invented by the Chinese and squeezing the stem forced the fluid to the nib and writing occurred. By the start of the medieval period the next innovation to the technology of writing instruments occurred. The next major innovation to come to light was the quill. This pen was first used in 700 AD and was used for more than a thousand years. The quill pen was lighter than its earlier cousin and it was the primary flight feather of a goose. It required a significant amount of labor to produce just one quill pen, but it was strong and durable once it was made. Quill pens allowed for the production of different styles of writing. The user would have to reapply ink after writing a few words and would have to watch out that there was not too much ink on the quill as this could cause a splotch. The quill was used to write many significant documents such as the Bible, the American Declaration of Independence and William Shakespeare's plays. It was lighter and portable and required a special knife to sharpen the quill. With the Industrial Revolution sweeping through Europe, the next major technological innovation was made to the writing pen. The next major development in the writing instrument was the metal point pen. In 1808, Brian Donkin, an English engineer, patented the steel point pen. These pens did not come into common use for a few more decades and finally came into use after being mass produced in 1830. In 1884, Lewis Waterman invented the first practical fountain pen. This pen was a leap forward in technology of the writing instrument Earlier forms of these pens were unsuccessful because of the tendency of ink spills. To prevent spills, the newer fountain pen was designed to carry its own supply of ink. The writing is similar to that of the quill and the pen would have to be refilled every once in a while to continue writing. The thing about the fountain pen is it would last a long time, it was portable and it carried its own ink supply. And finally we come to the ballpoint pen, which was invented by Laszlo and George Biro. The first pen was invented in 1938 and went into mass production in 1943. Technologically the ballpoint pen was a more advanced pen than its predecessors. The most notable improvement was that it did not need to be refilled for at least a year. It was more rugged than the fountain pen and it used a thicker ink and it had an improved point, type of point. The patent for this pen was bought by the British government and it became the writing tool of the British Air Force because it did not leak ink at higher altitudes. Conclusion. The evolution of the pen was a direct result of the development of the media for which it was written on. Each advancement and innovation to the writing instrument from the dawn of time was a 
to advance the progress of human civilization and its history. Each millennium provided a technological advancement to the writing tool and this allowed for the continued advancement of mass literacy. The advancements in the writing instrument did modify social structures in some cultures. For example, in ancient Egypt, only men could be scribes.